What's up guys? In this short tutorial I will show you how to fix the black screen issue in OBS Studio. There can be quite some reasons on why you are getting a black screen. That's why I will go through a bunch of potential fixes. If none of this helps you out then leave a comment and I will get back to you. First of all, open up OBS Studio and delete the source which gives you the black screen. For most of you this will be the game capture source. So just delete it and re-add it. Put the mode to capture any full screen application and uncheck the multi-adapter compatibility and force rescaling. Hit OK and make sure this little eyeball is checked. Otherwise the game capture will not show up. Next, I will check if your OS is running on 64 or 32 bit. To find out which version of your OS you are using, use the Windows key plus Y, which is a shortcut to open up your settings. Click on System and then on About. Here you can see which version of your OS is installed and if your computer has a 64-bit processor. Keep in mind which OS is running on your PC and open up your program files on a drive on which OBS Studio is saved on. Go to OBS Studio, bin and then choose either 32 or 64-bit. Lastly, you will have to find the OBS application in that folder, which you want to open up as an admin. So just right-click the application and select Run as Administrator. Next. And this will not be a fix but more of a workaround. Open up the game you want to record, change the video settings so that it's in windowed mode and record it with a display capture. This may induce some lag or stuttering and it's not an optimal solution, but you will be able to record your gameplay. You can always try to uninstall OBS and reinstall it on another drive. Make sure that you get the right version of your OS, 32 or 64 bit. Lastly, you can try to tweak your OBS video settings. As the base resolution, you should always use the recommended native screen resolution. In my case, it is 1080p. On advanced, you will see which renderer the software wants to use. Here it says Direct 3D11. This means that I need to have the DirectX 11 installed on my PC, so that OBS can render my videos. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.